Episode 9, Aaron's Redemption, Opening Scene, the episode opens with a montage of past missions where Brother Aaron's inventions have faltered at critical moments, explosions, equipment failures, and the concerned faces of his teammates replay in his mind. The scene transitions to Aaron alone in his dimly lit lab surrounded by blueprints, prototypes and screens displaying complex equations. Determination etched on his face, he works tirelessly on his latest project, a device he believes will be the ultimate shield against extraterrestrial threats, the Aegis Sphere. Introduction to Brother Aaron's struggle. Brother Aaron. A brilliant technical engineer whose confidence has been shaken by previous failures. Haunted by the fear of letting his team down he becomes obsessed with perfecting his new invention. Isolation and obsession. Aaron isolates himself from the rest of the team. He declines team meetings and training sessions. Ignores messages and calls from Brother Oran Z and Brother OJ. Misses important briefings on rising alien activities. His sole focus is the Aegis Sphere a device designed to generate a planetary shield capable of repelling any alien attack. However, repeated tests result in system overloads and unstable reactions. The team's concern, the rest of the brothers notice Aaron's absence and growing reclusiveness. Brother JJ expresses frustration, emphasizing the need for Aaron's expertise on current missions. Brother Orion suggests giving Aaron space, believing he'll come around. Brother Oni, having grown under Aaron's mentorship, is particularly worried and decides to reach out. Attempted intervention, Brother Oni visits Aaron's lab. Finds the lab in disarray, papers scattered, equipment overheating. Aaron is unkempt, eyes red from lack of sleep. Oni tries to persuade him to take a break and rejoin the team. Aaron dismisses him, insisting that this invention is the key to redeeming himself. Rising threat, meanwhile, Brother OJ detects unusual signals from deep space. A massive alien fleet is on a direct course to Earth. The species is identified as the Krellians, a warrior race seeking new planets to conquer. They are known for their advanced weaponry and impenetrable defenses. The team convenes without Aaron. Brother Oran Z assigns roles for Earth's defense. Brother JJ will lead the ground forces. Brother Orion and Brother Oni will coordinate evacuation plans for civilians. They acknowledge the need for Aaron's technological support but decide to proceed given the urgency. Aaron's breakthrough in his lab, Aaron experiences a breakthrough. Realizes the flaw in his design is a misalignment in the energy harmonics. Corrects the equations and initiates a final test. The Aegis Sphere activates successfully, creating a small but stable shield. Excited, he seeks to inform the team but overhears a distress call. The Krellian fleet has arrived sooner than anticipated. Earth's defense systems are failing against their onslaught. Inner conflict, Aaron grapples with guilt. Feels responsible for not being there when the team needed him. Doubts whether his device is ready for deployment. Remembers past failures and fears causing more harm. He recalls words of wisdom from Brother Oran Z. Our strength lies not in our infallibility, but in our willingness to stand up after we fall. Quote rejoining the team determined, Aaron rushes to the command center with the Aegis Sphere. The team is surprised but relieved to see him. He apologizes for his absence and explains his invention. Skeptical but hopeful, Brother Oran Z agrees to deploy the device. Deploying the Aegis Sphere, the plan is set. Brother Aaron and Brother OJ work to integrate the Aegis Sphere with Earth's satellites. Brother JJ, Brother Orion, and Brother Oni engage in defensive maneuvers to buy time. They face heavy resistance from Krellian ground forces that have begun landing. Intense battle scenes, the brothers fight valiantly showcasing their combat skills and teamwork. Civilians are evacuated safely due to their coordinated efforts. The Krellian's superior technology puts the brothers on the defensive, activating the planetary shield in the command center. Aaron and OJ synchronize the satellites, but an unexpected surge threatens to overload the system. Aaron realizes he must manually stabilize the core from within the Aegis Sphere's central hub. Knowing the risks, he proceeds despite OJ's protests, selfless sacrifice, inside the core chamber. Aaron endures intense energy waves as he adjusts the harmonics. Memories of his past failures flash before him but he pushes through, focusing on protecting his team and planet. With a final adjustment, the Aegis Sphere reaches full power. The shield engages, a brilliant energy field envelops Earth, repelling the Krellian attacks. Their ship's weapons are rendered ineffective and their systems begin to malfunction. The Krellian fleet, unable to penetrate the shield, decides to retreat.